and it's me Keanu. Today's video I'm back with another wig review. This video is also in collaboration with Augusta Beauty Outlet. Big thanks to Augusta Beauty Outlet for offering me this unit for your review and can I tell you we have been globe trotting in this unit and from coast to coast you guys want to know all the details. So without further ado if you want to see all the details on this unit just keep on watching. So this is the stock card on this unit. You're going to see all the details that you need to purchase this unit from Augusta Beauty Outlet. She is by Maid, M-A-Y-D-E, Maid Beauty. Brand new brand to my channel. So that would lead me to believe they're brand new in the beauty game. And let me tell you, they're bringing the heat. This is a 5 inch invisible lace part unit. Her name and the style that you will ask for again is Emmy. So the one that you're seeing right now is the FF430. So you're thinking, hmm, why are you holding the stock card, Keanu, to an FF427? Because your girl has this unit in two different colors. Aha, uh -huh. we like that, right? You're going to see several different styles in this unit. If I flip the stock card over, you will see that she comes in these beautiful caramel shades. She has a beautiful red, an uh, amazing blonde, and you know what? She is going to be necessary. I can see me wanting to purchase all four of these units or at least talking to my people at Augusta Beauty Outlet. You know, I ain't ashamed. I'm going to ask. Unlike a lot of the other units that I do try on here on my channel, this is an invisible lace part. That means there's no lace for you to cut. It is not a lace front, but boo, what you see is what you get. Hunty. When I say what you see is what you get, there is nothing for you to do. You're going to pull her out the pack, cut the stock card off, put her on your head, and slay. I'm going to give you guys a little bit more details on this unit right here because this is what's interesting to me. All of this is my hair. This unit is so thick around the hairline, but it really doesn't matter because it's a middle part. So when the wind blows, nobody knows that because the density is all the way around where the lace would typically be. And honey, I was just in Toronto and I had no problems with that wind blowing back. She just laid perfectly, perfectly sound. Let's go ahead and jump into wig construction. You'll see there are two combs in the front. There's also one comb in the back. And of course we have that adjustable strap. This unit, I would say, is probably on the medium head friendly side. My hair is a little bit thinner than a lot of other natural easters. I didn't have any problems with adjusting the cap down to fit my head. Actually, I didn't have to do any manipulation to this unit other than pop a little bit of concealer underneath the unit and put her right on and that was it. For those of you that have a little bit more hair, I'm thinking it's going to fit you equally as well. Just choose a dome cap that's going to fit your head. It's going to make the unit feel nice and snug and you're good to go. As far as coloring in this unit, mm, this being the FF430, to me the rooting is super duper dark, which is why I do have it in two different colors. So I'm going to show you the FF427, which she's been glow trotting around, honey. But if you want to see the comparison, there you go. FF430, FF427. Can you see how that makes such a big difference? So you have this beautiful lighter ombre, and it goes into a very similar brown. But the rooting, I think, is what makes this unit totally different. So again, FF427, again, FF430. I am absolutely obsessed with it. As you can tell, I do have two different versions of this unit. I love the ease and flow of this unit. It's super casual, super transitional for me and my lifestyle where I like a middle part. I'm obsessed with middle parts. They really allow me to show the makeup slayage when I'm working. And, you know, I don't think that you can manipulate this unit too much and flip her over to the side unless you're willing to give up some interest. I'm going to stand up for you guys. So you see that you have this beautiful body weight that comes all the way down and seriously right at my belly button. I'm about five feet tall. You're going to have that beautiful wave. And I love that the ombre transitions right about eyebrow and goes all the way down to the, to the boob. If you flip her around, again, you're going to get her all the way down to the boobs. It gives us those amazing inches that look like bundles that we like. It love those inches that drape right over the hiney because it's giving you that nice, comfort of casual glam all the way down the linear part of your back but what i'm noticing i am a earring wearer i really love how the tensils are evenly distributed all the way down like you have the flow of curl all the way down the inch of the hair so it's not like super tight at the root and then it goes into something straight or vice versa 
it really does look like you walk right out of a salon I have received so many compliments on this unit. Like I said, I've already gotten it in two different colors. I will be reinforcing that and purchasing it again and yet the FF427. But I think that it does brighten my complexion just a little bit. It photographs really, really nice. But I had this one on and nobody could really, really tell the difference. So I'm going to turn around again and let you guys see how the density in the unit is. Super lightweight, super shiny, but not in a bad way. This reminds me of, again, someone walking out of a hair salon that's gotten a very nice blowout and they've done really, really nice tonsil curls. Very easy. I brushed this one out several different times and you still have that nice bluster. I'm going to flip into the F427 and I'm going to go ahead and give you the cons on this unit so you are very aware with your purchase. I already switched over into the 427 and or FF427 and I am obsessed with how caramel like this one is this is totally more my vibe but I did wear this unit in Orlando and it was seriously almost 100 degrees super hot I took a ton of pictures outside this one actually went through the airport several times and unfortunately this unit did not perform as well as I want. You see the curl is not holding. This side did start to fall. So this is being my right side. It started to fall. I want to say that she was a little bit looser when I even purchased it. I could kind of tell that it wasn't as even as in the 430. So keep that in mind. I've already cut her as well. So I've had to go in and kind of razor the ends off of this one because it did get extremely, extremely frayed. Consider it more of a work hazard. I was in some extremely hot climates, but just cutting those few inches off, the unit is heat safe. She goes up to, I want to say they said 350 degrees. So I will be bringing her back to life. You'll see that the ends did go a little bit more straight, so you're not getting all of that luster that you had in the original unit that I had on. But she's not too bad that you can wear her over and over again as well. I'm going to tell you, I've had so many people ask me about this unit. Even though it's giving me a little difficulty here, I'm just going to tell you she's going to tangle. Make sure that you carry your brush with you and be ready to trim it because I think it was just for me wearing her in some extremely hot climates as well as me sweating as I was wearing the unit. Honey, there's no here nor there. I will be getting her again and I want you guys to comment down below. What do you think of Emmy? Do you think that she is giving me the sledge that I think she's giving me? 427 or 430? You guys know I love to know. Comment down below. You guys also know I love to connect with you, so make sure you connect with me. Follow me on all my social media links to never miss another upload. Make sure you comment again if you will be purchasing any. Check the link in the description box to find out where I received mine. Big thanks again to Augusta Beauty Outlet for offering me this unit for your review. Two thumbs up to them for being in the Augusta area to where I can actually walk into the store and purchase her right away. Until next time, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Hugs and kisses. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.